Vishakapatnam, also known as the Jewel of the East Coast, is one of the nine coastal districts in the state of Andhra Pradesh. With its administrative headquarters located at Vishakapatnam, it's located on the eastern shore of India, nestled among the hills of the eastern Ghats and facing the Bay of Bengal to the east. Vishakapatnam and the surrounding mandals face severe industrial and traffic pollution which is rapidly spreading. Another major problem is the garbage and biomedical waste that the hospitals are dumping in the surrounding areas that spreading infection all around. Due to the lack of foresight for a proper urban planning approach, the urban population is forced to live in slums. The district faces an impending water crisis due to the shrinkage in the capacity of the local reservoirs. This is caused due to the widespread damage to the catchments and extensive damage and contamination of the surface and groundwater sources. Apart from the drinking water and irrigation issues, the irrigation channels and drain bunds have turned into dumping yards. The biggest issue is that of unemployment among youth. Elected representatives who have even gone on to become ministers have failed to solve the problem. Agriculture is the main livelihood of people. The farmers are highly dependent on bovels for irrigation and need uninterrupted power supply. Despite the rainfall and humid conditions, the people suffer a shortage of portable drinking water. Besides these, the usual problems of bad roads, civic issues and drainage problems continue to plague this district. Construction of wing flyovers, flyovers expansion and roads construction to solve the traffic problems are also needed. Proper roads and connectivity to the inner rural regions, housing sites for the poor are some of the problems faced by the people in the district. Lok Sabha constituency in Vishakhapatnam is one of the 25 Lok Sabha constituencies in Andhra Pradesh and is the biggest parliamentary constituency in the state. The Vishaka LS constituency is going to face a four-fold fight between MVV Satyanarayana of the YSRCP, D. Purandeshwari of the BJP, Bharat M. of the TDP and V. Lakshmi Narayana of the Janasena. Purandeshwari, who is the daughter of Telugu Desam party founder N.T. Ramarao and was earlier elected from Vishakapatnam as Congress candidate in 2009 before jumping into the BJP. She is testing her waters for the second time with Saffron Party. The TDP candidate M. Bharat is a new entrant to politics but a known face in Vizag. He is the grandson of the founder of Keetam University, M. V. V. S. Murthy and also Nandamuri Balakrishna's second son-in-law. It is believed that owing to pressure from Balaya, Chandra Babu had to give the ticket to Bharat. The other surprising entry is former J.D. of the CBI, V.V. Lakshmi Narayana, who joined the Janasena and is contesting from Vishakapatnam. A prominent builder, the YSRCP's MVV Satyanarana has been named as the candidate for the Vishakapatnam Lok Sabha seat. Popular gynecologist, social worker Dr. K. Satyavati has been announced as the candidate for Anakapalli parliamentary constituency. For Araku Lok Sabha seat, Good Day to Madhavi, a school teacher from the Kandodra community and daughter of late CPI MLA G. Demudu secured the seat. In Anakapalli, it's a fight between YSRCP's AVSS Amarnath Gudiwada versus TDP's Pila Govinda Satyanarayana. In Pendurti, it's YSRCP's Adip Raj versus TDP's Bandaru Satyanarayana Murthy. In Elamanchali, YSRCP's Uppalapati Venkataramana Murthy Raju Kanna Babu Raju versus TDP's Panchakarla Ramesh Babu. In Narsi Patnam, YSRCP's Petla Umashankar Ganesh will take on TDP's senior leader and minister Chintakayala Ayana Patrudu. In Chodavaram, YSRCP's Dharmashri Karanam will be pitted against sitting MLA Kali Dindi Suryana Naga Sanyasi Raju of the TDP, who is trying for a hat trick. Madugula, YSRCP's Budi Muthyala Naidu, will face TDP MLA Gavi Reddy Rama Naidu. In Payaka Rao Pet SC, YSRCP's Golla Babu Rao will take on TDP's Dr. Budumuri Bangaraya. In Paderu ST, YSRCP's Bhagya Lakshmi will take on TDP's Giddi Ishwari. In Araku Valley ST, YSRCP's Chetty Falguna will take on TDP's Kidari Shravan Kumar. In Vishakapatnam East, YSRCP's Akaramani Vijaya Nirmala will take on sitting MLA and TDP's Velagapudi Ramakrishna. In Vishakapatnam West, YSRCP's Vijay Prasad Malla will take on TDP's PGVR Naidu. In Vishakapatnam South, YSRCP's Dronam Raju Srinivas will take on TDP's Vasupalli Ganesh Kumar. In Vishakapatnam North, it will be YSRCP's KK Raju versus TDP's 
Education Minister Ghanta Srinivas Rao. In Gajuwaka, there will be a strong triangular battle here where two strong leaders, the sitting TDP MLA Palla Srinivas Rao and the YSRCP Stipala Nagi Reddy, will be pitted against Janasena Chief Pawan Kalyan. This is Pawan's first election and he is also contesting from Bhimavaram to test his luck. In Bhimili, YSRCP's Muttam Setti Srinivasa, who is also known as Avanti Srinivas, will take on senior TDP leader Sabbam Hari.